welcome to mama my strength part of my daily life friends if you like this video do subscribe like share comment and hit the bell icon good morning friends how are you all doing hope you all are fine yes my day has started i'm just giving you a little tour as usual for the morning I haven't started my puja. <laughs> no. I have already started my puja as you have already seen but the diya I don't light it completely because I live in an apartment and we do have fire alarm system here and for safety reasons I do light a small uh, diya that I the diya wick that I showed you that I normally purchase from online. So don't get alarmed. Yes, it's refreshing when I see my kitchen nice and clean and uh, I don't have to worry about other things. My Milo is already made, I just have to drink it. And I've got a bowl ready to prepare my daughter's breakfast, which I will be doing shortly. All my laundry has been done. I have a washing machine so I do all my laundry inside as well as dry. Sometimes I have to dry uh, clothes. I have a dryer here. Just a little tip for mummies. Again, if you have to do laundries, don't wait for the next morning. Do it night time and then morning time your work is done. Here my daughter's breakfast is ready. She's just having her breakfast. You all know by now kids are having online classes. So they need to be prepped with everything before the class starts. So here I'm starting my cooking and I'm making shrimp curry today. And you, for you guys, there's a separate video uh, made on shrimp curry or jinga curry. Mummies, if you are having difficulties and you've got kids at home, husband who's working and you've got lots of things to do inside the house even though you are a stay of stay at home mom i can understand that you are not always free you have got a lot of things to do manage your kids manage your family clean the house do the laundry so much burden on you a little trick for you pre-cut all your vegetables that you will be using for the week just to save your time do your laundry night time again make sure your living room your kitchen is neat and tidy so in the morning when you will get up you will only have to make the bed and do your bedroom that's it and for the next day you will obviously have to make meals but then look behind that you are able to save a lot of time and if you cook a meal that can last you for lunch and dinner or maybe you can prepare two three dishes that can last you for the day my dear mommies you will save time for family time when kids and your spouse are having family time and enjoying you can be part of them you won't be neglected you won't be upset that oh i couldn't join them i couldn't watch my late night uh, tv program you know i do understand your life is very busy but try this trick here i'm sure it will help resolve your problem and at the same time allow you to have more bondings with your spouse and your kids i'm preparing roti and today just because i made shrimp and ojinga curry my daughter will not be eating it so for her i will have to make a um, quesadilla Friends, quesadilla can be made in various versions, but my daughter likes cheese. Some of you can add even, um, um, you know, other ingredients that your kids enjoy. And for Indian people that do not know what uh, quesadilla is, they are um, Mexican uh, rotis or tortillas. 
but the only thing is that that they fill it and fill it up with cheese and some of them have got meat some have got beans you know so my daughter likes it so i'm making cheese quesadilla for her right now because straight after class she will be having her lunch break and i want her meal to be ready for the day and believe me quesadillas cheese quesadilla with a roti it's very easy to make another tip that i would like to share with you when it comes to kids meal my child really was like not too much into fruits so i am giving i'm still forcing her to eat the fruits sometimes i give her the fresh ones and most of the times um we have the cup ones we do send her uh we do pack her lunch bag with the fruits but she will return it back um unopened but now i since i'm home and since she is with me i make sure that every lunch time she gets her fruit and she finishes it with her meal and in the evening yes she does have her yogurt and this may alter because children sometimes can get bored of eating same type of things so you need to mix things like for instance if i'm baking something i will not give her uh, a big snack tray because i know she will like to eat the baked item or the baked food that i'm making for her as you know that i live in an apartment and my apartment is smaller and some people may be living in or some mummies may be living in the bigger houses it may be very very hard for you to manage a big house then please divide the house maybe upstairs downstairs you can do in different days you don't have to do everything in one day and for laundries you can prepare uh, pick up two days you know prepare a timetable for you on which day you want to do what and this way again you will save a lot of time so here you can see i'm turning and talking to you guys i'm making the quesadilla the quesadilla has to be crispy if not my daughter will not eat it so this is her lunch now i'm baking cookies and this is the brand that i'm using it's nestle and my daughter likes macadamia nuts just like her mom and this is a very easy uh, pre-mixed cookie that i brought from walmart you can see how many cookies can be made but just because the ingredients are squashed you cannot see all the cubes uh, straight away so here i've taken it out and i'm going to put it in the oven it's it's also mixed with white chocolate chip so now i've started the baking and you can see that the oven is there my daughter um has got a schedule of classes going on each day she has two sessions so right now she's doing her school work straight after class she goes to play